Good morning, everyone. So I'm about to get headed out on trail. Um, <clears throat> uh, you can't see it because I'm not in night mode and you could only see it in pictures, but the stars are amazing. I'll put some pictures up here that I took. Um, yeah, so I'm just climbing up this mountain, straight up, 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 straight up. All right, let's go. Look at this view. Also, I just met uh, Stella, Heidi. She's just up ahead. Um, it's a big group of like six. Uh, yeah, so pretty cool to meet them. So I'm taking a break. It was nice to hike with some people for a little bit. Uh, I'm going to go, I'm going to try to make it about 10 more miles. I don't know if that's going to happen. Just depends on the snow. Uh, yeah, just taking it easy. I have plenty of food, um, obviously plenty of water. Uh, and we'll see, I might be taking the blue al uh, alternate. So that will get me lower in elevation and it'll give me a break from the snow a little bit, which I desperately need because my knees are struggling from all the post hauling. But uh, yeah, um, almost to town, maybe two days, one and a half. I think two, more like two. 
two days, two, maybe three. We'll see, I don't know. Uh, yeah, just taking it easy. Let me show you my view. There's a waterfall right there. I don't know if you can see it or not. Pretty though. And I go that way. Dry trail for once, which is nice. That was a mountain chicken. That's what I call them, mountain chickens. Gorgeous. All right, so the trail goes up right there. See the trail's right there, but we obviously didn't want to go this way. So we have to go up and then that way. So it looks like there's no other way. Um, so I gotta go sade down here. We'll see how this goes. I'm gonna put my phone away, of course. Woo. All right, let's do it. All right. Successful glissade. Um, yeah, I'm gonna keep going. The clouds look pretty nasty. It's probably gonna storm on me soon. <laughs> so yeah, that's where I glissaded from. And now, let's get moving. Ooh, I'm in a post hole right here. You can see those post holes. 
So I'm taking a break, eating some Cheez-Its. And look, you could see the people walking across. I'm not sure if you can see it because the camera can't zoom in much, but they're right there. I could hear him talking. That's how much, like how silent it is out here and how it echoes. So I've set up camp early. Um, I post hold over here big time and like to my waist and then I couldn't get my foot out for like 20 minutes. So I was digging with my ice axe and just kept digging and digging and finally got my foot out. And now I've just decided to stop for today because oh, that was exhausting and um, it'll be better to get the miles done in the morning with uh, not so slushy snow because I don't want to be post holing like that again. Uh, so yeah, I have camp set up. I'm going to make myself a meal and just relax. I didn't get much sleep last night. Um, I don't know why. So my body's just done. Um, so I'm going to try to get sleep tonight. It's only 2 o'clock. So uh, let's see how my sleep goes. <laughs> Hopefully I get to sleep. All right, let me make my meal. So I'm making sweet pork and rice. Um, gonna try to get as many calories in today as possible. So I have energy in the morning. <sighs> Decided to keep moving after eating. I definitely needed that little break. Um, I ate a peak refuel meal and now I have some more energy to get down the trail. Um, yeah, so the snow has been okay with post holding so far. Hopefully that doesn't change because I just said that. <laughs> But now I'm like four miles, I think three and a half actually, uh, to Elwood Pass. So let's see how far. <sighs> it's hard just trying to decide which tracks to take because both of them look like they're post holing. Uh, let's try this one. Uh oh. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Oh no, this one's bad. It's alright, it's alright, it's alright. It's okay. Phone away. Hey everyone, so. I made it to where I'm gonna camp for the night. It's only 0.9 away from Elwood Pass, I believe that's what it's called. Uh, so I'll get there tomorrow morning and then I'm going to take the blue route. 
Um, it'll, I'm taking the blue route. My knees are just jacked up from the post holing from this section. So I thought, why not give myself a little rest, my body a little rest, and do the 18.5 on uh, the blue route, which is lower in elevation, so it'll be safer and it will uh, help my body. <laughs> um, anyways, I'm in camp and now I'm just gonna rest and eat something. I'm gonna eat like a cookie or something. Um, and yeah, so 14.1 I believe for today. Uh, we'll see how many miles I get done tomorrow. I'm sure it's gonna be a lot because I'm gonna be pushing for town. <laughs> we'll see. All right, good night everyone.